The most popular Republican in the United States Congress was just knifed. Matt Gates right now, and this is exactly what I said, go back to our videos, you know, what was it, two and a half, three weeks ago, when Matt Gates pulled this thing off, where he took eight Republicans and worked with all of the Democrats to get rid of McCarthy. You may not have liked McCarthy. Now, now we know Trump backed McCarthy. You may have thought he was too swampy or whatever. I thought he was doing some good things. Thomas Massey, we showed you that video, who's the most libertarian member of Congress said this was the most conservative Congress he had ever been part of. You may not have liked McCarthy, but Gates did make a deal with the devil here, and we're starting to see the details of that now, because even if you agree with Gates, right, and you wanted the Republicans to be much better, and of course we would all want the Republicans to be better and the Democrats to be better, Gates made a deal with the Democrats, and now the Republican Party is left in tatters, uh, but, but Gates is mostly pissed at the Republicans who did not all fall in line with Jordan, and to that end, I agree with him. Take a look. The, the most popular Republican in the United States Congress was just knifed by a secret ballot in a private meeting in the basement of the Capitol. It's as swampy as swamp gets, and Jim Jordan deserved better than that. All right, well, I certainly agree that Jim Jordan deserved better than that. I can't speak to the truth if it happened in the basement of the Capitol or anywhere else, but this was the fear, right? Gates, you were gonna take out a guy who was doing some good stuff, McCarthy, right? Was I happy with the Ukraine stuff or whatever, but like basically, as Massey said, he was. this was the most conservative Republican Congress that we have had in a long, long time, right? He was tighten the, tightening the belt on some stuff. Gates made the deal with the devil. Now it looks like the devil's striking back and we could end up in a situation, we we, at this point, we could honestly end up in a situation where the Democrats will end up with the speaker even though they don't have the majority because the whole thing is so in flux.